we win here. And we're not going to be the guys that didn't win. This weekend, Maine baseball plays their final home games of 2024 with still a lot on the line. Every game at this point is playoff baseball, and we're just we're just going one game at a time, obviously. We know the situation. Win two, and Maine clinches the final spot in the America East playoffs. I got faith in the guys. I know we can do it. But regardless of the result, several Black Bears will suit up for the final time at Mahaney Diamond. I'm trying not to think about it. I probably have a pretty good idea of what the future's looking like, but you know, as of right now, it's still May. I'm still wearing, you know, a main uniform, so just worrying about the playoffs and this weekend coming up. I really try not to think about it much, just because when you think about the end, you kind of take away from what's in front of you. And, um, you know, being here every day, um, I've wanted to be present in the moment. Connor Goodman has spent five years in Orono and his impact has been felt on the field, but maybe even more so off of it. He brought something here that is really, we, we, we were missing. You know, off the field, you know, excellence, with on the field excellence, and you know, we have it, and we have a lot of guys doing it, and he's showing what it's like to be, uh, be a real black bear. I was just a kid from Miami who uh, didn't know if I even had a career in college baseball, and Coach Durba took a chance on me, and it's uh, it's been the greatest honor to be here. And then there's Jeremiah Jenkins. While undecided right now, signs point to him hearing his name called in this year's MLB draft. Knowing this is probably my last year here, I just got to take everything, you know, in stride. I'm happy to be here. It's exciting. And if it is, so unquote, my last year here, I want to go out with a win, you know. Well deserved, too. Jenkins making history this season as the only player in America East history with back-to-back -back 20 home run years. Well, aside from him being the best player that, that the America East has seen possibly in ever, right? I mean, I don't know if that's a, that's a crazy statement to say. He's just a really good person. For me, that's the mark of really what we're about. But while the end may be near, these guys have a full plate in front of them, and they're focused on only one thing. I never want to say it's over, so hopefully we keep going and we keep winning, and uh, you know we'll see you in we'll see you in the tournament, see you in a regional super, whatever's next. From Orono, I'm Tyler Cruz, ABC7 Fox 22 Sports.